This is Robin S. Voyage. This will be my motorcycle vlog, and this is just a short montage just to kind of show you what it's like to drive a motorcycle in the Philippines. I live out in uh, Diet, which is in Bicol region, and the primary mode of transportation for most people, as you can see, are tricycles. That's a, basically a small motorcycle with a sidecar and roof attached. Many people in America don't know what they are. They, I've seen them described as little trucks, uh, tuk-tuks. They're not any of those things. They're literally a motorcycle with a sidecar and a roof. And it cost, they just raised 10 pesos for two kilometers and one, one peso per kilometer after that. Pretty cramped for a big fat guy like me. But I really do enjoy riding here in the Philippines. Uh, there was... I went through three phases. First, I was terrified uh, because it is chaos. Uh, very few people actually have any real driver training here. Some do, but 90% don't. And <clears throat> it's pretty evident just on how uh, they don't obey things like basic things like lane splitting. You're not supposed to do that here, but as you can see, everybody does, including myself, because you wouldn't get anywhere if you didn't lane split here in the Philippines. Uh, the other thing is uh, pedestrian safety. There's really none of that. You got to really watch for them because they'll just walk out blindly and traffic really just will do everything they can to go around them or threaten to run them over, that kind of thing. Uh, my motorcycle is a Yamaha YTX125. It's actually built for the Philippines, for rugged use in the Philippines. Tough little motorcycle. And even with 125 cc, it's got enough power to pu you know to push me around even through the mountains, so I'm happy with it. Anyway, there'll be more vlogs to come. Just wanted to say hi, put this out there, and let you know that good things are coming. And uh, always have a helmet cam on, so you'll be getting some interesting videos from uh, Southeast Asia. For all my American friends uh, who think that it's dangerous to ride in America, no, it's not. It really is quite safe because even the good drivers, or sorry, even the bad drivers there are pretty good. Talk to you later, guys. Enjoy. Bye.